Much of what we know about the early Middle Ages is thanks to monks who wrote a chronicle of all the important events of each year. There's a lot going on in the Saxon world. And for years it's been almost impossible to keep up. We've got invasions. Civil war. Saxons. Angles. Jutes. Danes. Vikings. Normans. And goodness knows what else. And now you won't have to miss a thing thanks to... Anglo-Saxon Chronicle Magazine from Peterborough. Yes, you can read the Anglo-Saxon Chronicle in any of these five locations in Middle Ages England. Read how Earl Elfgar was outlawed for admitting being a traitor. Well, hang on. According to my Worcester version, he was outlawed despite having done very little wrong. Yeah, not having an issue. It says that he didn't do anything wrong at all. Is someone checking we're all telling the same story here? Well, I'm not. We've just been writing whatever we want. Yeah, us too. Well, what happens when everyone finds out we're telling different versions of history? Well, not much. I mean, they're not allowed to read it anyway. It's for monks only. Cool. Cool. Well, I won't tell anyone if you won't. I definitely won't. I'm taking a vow of silence. Mm -hmm. There goes the key. Anglo-Saxon Chronicle, the magazine everyone in Saxon England should read. Well, as long as they're monks. What happened to the vow of silence? Starting now. <laughs>